you care enough to send the very best? Isn't that what Hallmark says, something along those lines? We all search for the perfect card for our loved ones, and I think I've got that idea for you right now. How about flowers in the rain? Hi, I'm Brian Peterson, author of Understanding Exposure, Understanding Shutter Speed, and Learning to See Creatively. What I'm about to show you will give you the opportunity to make what I think will be a very moving, touching, loving greeting card, among other things. I'm using an oscillating sprinkler, which is making rain fall on those flowers. Backlit rain, I might add. The critical part about this shot is the exposure time. This is all about creative use of shutter speed. 1 60th of a second. That's the only speed that'll work. I know it. I've done this many times. A 1 25th, the streaks are too short. A 1 30th, the streaks are too long. 1 60th of a second. So set your shutter speed to a 60th. Adjust your exposure with the aperture or one of those times if you prefer. Go to shutter priority with the shutter speed at a 60th of a second and literally just compose. Wait for the rain to come right on those flowers and fire away. Take a look. Now don't think this idea is limited to flowers because it's not. I've had great success with doing this with fruits as well. Check out this bowl of strawberries. Now here's another novel idea with the idea of rain once again. How about a person in the rain? Using the sprinkler once again, you simply put the person backlit against the sun with the addition of a reflector. Once again, fool everybody, make them think you are out shooting in the rain. Until next time, this is Brian Peterson saying, keep shooting.